what does the body do when it first enters a space, you know, and, and there are things that are often subconscious, but it's like the lighting, the sound, the smell, really activating the senses. Um, Chiedska Paspanojka's new show at the Perry Gallery in the AGB creates a space and place all its own. It's about how to bridge the gap between where one lives um, and where one calls home and where the spirit lies and where the heart lies. Connecting to sort of like belief systems and ways of being from where I come from in Zimbabwe. Um, these ideas around like collectivity and community and like what, what, what's possible in that way. Creating an environment, an installation using clay that would possibly um, give the audience an experience of being transported to somewhere new or something different than what they're usually used to. Um, and almost using clay to translate my memories uh, into the physical space in the gallery. During an artist residency in Zimbabwe, Chiedza learned how to process clay, from digging it out of the ground to making pots and firing them. Over the summer, they had a residency working in the clay studio at the Art Gallery of Burlington. Building structures that look much like what they would find in Zimbabwe. And by creating these rock formations out of clay, it's taking these two different uh, natural elements, one to inform the other. The clay certainly informed the work when it cracked in the kiln, an event that might have upset some artists, but not Chiedza. I'm like, no, this is perfect. Perfect. Like, this is actually better than I could have imagined it to be, you know? And for me, working with clay is a really collaborative process. Like, I'm working with the clay, but the clay is a material that is responsive and gets tired and it goes into the fire and you don't know how it's going to come out. And that actually is really important for me. You have the opportunity to check out Chiedza's work for the rest of the year. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.